<laughs> Such an obvious thing to do, right? Um, I'm just here waiting for my guide. I don't know if I should wait for him here or I should just get going. Yeah, I'm just super excited. This whole trip of oh, it rained, it rained today. I'm very, very excited about where it's going to be. Oh my god, I need to buy something. I, I, I came out in slippers. <laughs> Anyways, I am, um, yeah, so I'm very excited about going. Oh my god, I'm so shy. I am happy as usual in this town. And I'm excited to go to Shawin, which is a blue city. And I'm just, yeah, just super excited. I can't believe it, it's my first time there. You cannot imagine how happy I am. And like, the only thing that I don't like that much is that I'm going alone. Like, imagine if I could go with the girls that watch me. That would be a dream. So yeah, I'm gonna leave a link here in the description because I wanna see who actually could go with me. Because if there's people who would go with me on a trip, on a, I don't know, a nice trip where we just get to know each other, find friends and stuff, like, would you be up for that? Because honestly, I would plan a whole trip just for us. I would plan the whole trip just to go and get to know each other. So let me know if you would actually be down for that. I, I'm, I'm more than down, like I'm the first one who's down. So I'm gonna leave a link for you to leave your email and we can, I don't know, like just if something happens, if it's many of us doing this, then I'm actually gonna plan something. So yeah. <laughs> Today again, I'm gonna try a new, ooh, a new juice and it's beetroot and I think banana juice or beetroot juice I don't like beetroot as a salad but I'm gonna try it like this I mean I'm not gonna try it, I'm gonna force myself to drink it it's actually good like it's, it's not bad like you just have to get used to it So here I was setting up the camera to send proof to my mom that I'm eating well in Morocco and drinking my veggies. She always tells me to drink and eat veggies, especially beetroot for the low iron. So I wanted to make her proud. And this was my mom's response. She communicates with me through stickers because she doesn't know how to read or write. It's cute, right? Here I decided to retouch my makeup because I have this thing that my makeup gets ruined and I never retouch it and I always wonder like why other girls look perfect all day and it's because they actually retouch it so today I wanted to be like the girls like the other girls <laughs> so yeah this is the secret just retouch your makeup We stopped after an hour of driving in this place to see the view and let me tell you, the camera doesn't do it justice. It's one of those views that make you feel like, yes, this definitely had to be created by someone. <laughs> to 
to be honest it wasn't in my plans to wear this but this lady was so kind i thought why not do it and it only costed me 50 cents literally like that's nothing then i took it off and we got going hey guys so i reached oh i was gonna do this before the sunglasses but we reached to the town uh, we're going to the old town now and Oh my god, I almost got hit by, by a bike. I recorded this cute place where ladies gather to wash their clothes. <laughs> the sudden cut was so funny because I was asking about these things that you see on the screen and the tour guide said that's Sibsi. It's um a type of thing pipe that people used to smoke, you know what? You're seeing yourself. You're very beautiful. <laughs> Hola. Oh. <laughs> I'm blue. As you can see here, I was exploring the town and seeing the streets, they were so pretty and here it hit me that these places, they're not just aesthetic places to take pictures, they're actual neighborhoods, these are homes, there's people who live here and it was so crazy to me, like oh my god. <laughs> I'm still not over the fact that these are homes. There's people that live inside and I'm here just taking pictures next to their homes. It's so beautiful. Like the feeling here is so crazy. I really wish you could go here and feel what I felt. I don't know. I know this picture is like sideways, but yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Can <laughs> <laughs> Him. He made me so many videos. I'm gonna show you. Um, 
this is his home. Like he's literally using his home as his orange business. <laughs> Such a kind man. <laughs> Zayn. Shut. I feel like no matter what I show from this town, it doesn't make it justice. It's so pretty. Everything's so beautiful here. We're gonna go into this restaurant, it's called Shehi Shem. Oh wow, so pretty. I sat here to have lunch. I'm so hungry and weak from walking so much around town. Um, yeah. So now we ordered a Moroccan salad. Too bad, yeah? No, he sings well. I won't, I won't give up my day job. <laughs> In Spain, we, we have a saying that if you sing, like the people who sing bad, it rains on them. Oh. So I think you sing well. We, 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 want, we, want, it, we want it to rain. The rain's oh. coming Friday. <laughs> oh, really? This is the girlfriend of Aziz. 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 زين ونريك كنت بني شوية كبيرة أجيلي واسعة بزاف صراحة عجبتني I just feel this thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be staying overnight in this town, and I feel like mm, this horrible feeling, like when you don't feel home. Oh, veggies. Oh. 
Ooh, someone put this as oh, why is it not focusing? Ah. Oh. It's the Palestinian flag. Assalamu guys, it's 1 a.m. That's why my face looks like this. I had dinner, I was working on some things at the restaurant and now i'm heading home i was at the hotel and they switched my room because i actually i had can i didn't cancel i just told them i'm not gonna come and then i ended up coming like i came and i got a new room with them and i actually left the room that i got in uh, the blue city because i was gonna be there but then i had this horrible feeling like i I just entered and I was like, no, no, like I, I just felt like crying. I don't know, like this sort of a feeling that you get when you don't sleep at home. When I don't know if you've ever had sleepovers as a kid, but you know when you wake up and you're just somewhere that you don't belong to. That's what I felt um, in the Blue City. So I was like, okay, I really like the day. I had an amazing day, but sleeping there. Even if it means like like I lose my my next day tour, I'm not sleeping there. I don't know, I just had this feeling. I had this feeling and I'm trying to learn how to follow like my intuition, my feelings. <laughs> so I'm learning how to do that and that's why I did it. I'll... <laughs> so I'm gonna drive today. I'm here fixing my hijab and I forgot that I'm actually driving. <laughs> hey guys, so I reached my room finally and oh, I I am very, very, very tired. I had to get um, an ibuprofen because I am. I have terrible back pain. I have really, really bad mood swings. And oh my god, I think my camera is dirty. No, it wasn't. So yeah, I had terrible mood swings today. Um, <laughs> You know, girls know this, uh, that there's a time of the month where, like, you can't, like, keep up with, like, the ups and downs in one day. So, uh, I was in the Blue City. I was so excited, so happy. And now, like, like, half an hour ago, I was so good. And then after that, I was, like, in a very, like, antagonist type of mood like no to everything and now I'm like chill it's like it's like I don't know it's like very confusing to me but yeah I I loved I loved being in the city I enjoyed uh the tour it was amazing there was so many things um uh, to see and it's like I didn't get enough I I wanted to be there more during the day but as soon as it was night I was like okay no, I cannot do this. I booked a hotel, like, the money is left, like, I, we couldn't return it. So I booked it, and I didn't stay. I literally went, and I was like, no, I don't want this. I, I don't want to, like, the room felt like, like, I, like, I wasn't home. So I had to leave. And I came back to Tanja and then like instantly, instantly, like the minute I stepped in Tanja, I felt like my mood going back to normal. I was energetic, like, whoa, so much like, I don't know, energy, euphoria. I am trying to listen to my instincts more often. And this time it was like a very, very strong feeling of like, no, I don't want to be here. I don't know what the reason is, like, why I don't want to be here, why I don't want to sleep here, but I just don't want, I can't. And I literally felt like crying, and I cried. I was like, in my head, no, I miss my mom, like, that type of feeling. <laughs> I, of course I miss my mom, 
No, but like, it's not that I actually miss my mom. It's like that type of feeling. I don't know if it makes sense. So I cried and I was like, no, I can't stay here. So I left and I came back here and I no longer cried. <laughs> it's it's a bit like crazy if you think about it. But yeah, overall it was amazing. Uh, it's my first time in the Blue City. Yes, I know it's embarrassing because I'm Moroccan. <laughs> I'm Moroccan and this is my first time in the Blue City. But I never had the chance this this um, summer I had the chance to go, but I was like, oh, I don't feel like going. I was not in the mood for anything. As you know, my breakup happened not long ago. So around that time, I was like, you know, very like not in the mood for much. So yeah, and last summer I didn't go to because I don't know. I, I also wasn't in the mood, I think. <laughs> so yeah, it didn't happen. It just didn't happen. Anyways, uh, I still need to go wash my face. Oh my god, the angles on this is, are just crazy. <laughs> You're seeing my double chin. You know that I actually don't look like this in person? Like, I'm, I'm prettier than this. Like, if you think I'm pretty, I'm actually prettier. <laughs> I'm joking. Well, I'm not joking, actually. What was I gonna say? Yes, the instinct thing, the instinct. Oh my god, I keep forgetting. Yes, it felt so good when I followed my instinct for the first time. Because last time I didn't follow my instinct, it costed me As I was saying, follow your instinct. Because you never know. Like, imagine if, Allah Alam, my heart, I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna stay there. Because if I stayed there, maybe, I don't know, something would have happened in that uh, hotel room. Or maybe the next day I was going to go and actually take you with me to a place that has like marijuana and stuff. Because uh, the Blue City actually is the city that produces the most marijuana in the world. And I wanted just to go there and like see the um, things like for myself and just explore around. And imagine, Allah Alam, maybe imagine if I went there and something happened, like, it's not illegal, by the way, to go there and look, because um, the plants are legal in Morocco if you use them for, like, medical things and stuff. So the people, the owners, are legal owners. And, yeah, but, like, imagine if I stayed there, I went there, and maybe there was someone bad who tried to hurt me, so... So, like, I don't know, everything has khair. Even if, you know, I don't know, it was like an inconvenience. I came back home late and stuff. At least it was, I don't know, it's a lost plan. Like, it's like, I don't know, lately I feel like I'm I'm, I'm trusting more a lost plan. And not getting angry at the things that he plans for me. For example, if he wants me to go home. If he wants me to um, break my leg, I'm like, okay, alhamdulillah. Maybe if I didn't break my leg, I would have died. So if there's a worse option to whatever happened to you, it's like, okay, alhamdulillah. Because maybe if this didn't happen, something way worse would have happened. Maybe I broke my leg so that I don't go to this place tomorrow and I stay home and I actually receive something amazing. I don't know, it's like... It's like everything that I do that happens in my life is just going to take me somewhere way better than where I am in my life. It's like, I just feel like Allah is just, he's like my best friend. Mm, I just feel like Allah is, is this, I just feel like Allah does things in a very mysterious way. And they're amazing things always. Like there's no there's no such thing as bad when it comes from Allah. Even if we think it's bad with our human brain, it's actually not bad. So yeah. I don't know. 